My name is Felicia, and I have stage 3 ovarian cancer. My kid's father suggested that I tried to go smoke because I had sobered up from the pills um, over one night and I refused to take them in the morning and I was in incredible pain on top of having the jonesing for the pills. Like, my mind just telling me, take them, take them, take them, you need them, you need them. You're, you're going to be in even worse condition if you don't take them, you better take them, you know? And the addiction on my mind was was the worst part. It was it was horrible, and and I went out in our backyard and I smoked, and I came back in and ev everything looked different. Everything wasn't like paused and stopped and and just just over. Like I look around and and I notice that they had painted the living room and. You know, just all the different things like like Connor running around and like having fun doing his little ABC dance and, and copying like songs off the computer and stuff like that. And I'm sitting there looking at him. I'm like, he remembers songs? Like, when did that happen? You know, things like that come in. I came in, I was actually able to eat instead of going four or five days without eating and then just randomly blacking out and having someone find me in a bathroom. I was able to sit there and make a sandwich. And not just look at it and throw it away or look at it and just give it to whoever walked by. I was able to sit down and actually eat and start getting the nutrition that my body needed so that I could stop blacking out. I was able to to determine like like what I needed in my life and what I didn't and I was able to actually think straight and I was able to do everything. I was just so completely overwhelmed that, that I'd been sitting here for so long on these pain pills that I thought it was the only way to, to help get rid of everything that was ailing me and come to find out this little plant that grows out of the ground that, you know, all natural comes along and it's like, here, let me be your friend. And it befriended me and, and I'm not a zombie. I'm not, I'm, I'm me again. I'm able to be myself again. I, I, I have my personality back. I'm able to actually do things with people. It's just it's just very overwhelming thinking that that, you know, all the, the money that's put into pharmaceuticals and, you know, here, take a depression pill, here, take this pain pill, here, take this, you know, here, take that. Like this one little thing that grows out of the ground that that, you know, the the side effect, euphoria, is the main side effect from it, you know, not nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, stomach cramps, you know, like bleeding colon, all the other things that you get from taking all these pills that that are supposed to be helping you but are in turn making you worse. So uh, I was, I was, I, I did cry. I was very overwhelmed and I was happy that, that I finally let somebody just talk to me about it and tell me like, no, you need, just try it. Just try it once and if you don't like it, then I'll leave you alone. I'll never ask you to do it again. And I did. I've been doing it ever since. Life is great now. It really is. I'm, I'm happy all the time. The quality of my life is actually a lot better as compared to before. I didn't really have a life. It was just me and there was nothing. And now my I have everything. I have everything that I could ever want. My kids are happy. I have my family. I have a roof over my head. Um, I mean, I still go through pain, a little bit of pain and things like that, but now I can function. Now I can be part of a, like a social crowd. I can actually go out and I have a life instead of just sitting there rotting on the couch. Nobody notices when, you know, they walk by. They don't, I've just been there for so long, nobody sees me. And now everybody sees me. Everybody knows what I'm doing because now I actually have a life. I'm able to contact my friends and and get together with them. I'm able to go out and see my family. I'm able to, to mentally and physically be able to do everything that I wanted to do. You know? Nothing is holding me back now. I don't I don't have anything there on my mind or body telling me that I can't do it. You know? It's it's helped it's opened me up a lot. Um, it, it helps me with my pain, it helps with uh, my memory actually a lot. Most people don't think that, no, they're, no, it helps a lot with my memory because I'm very forgetful. I have a lot of cancer toxins in my blood and so I'll forget a lot of stuff and it's, it's amazing how if I smoke I'll remember all this stuff. I'm like, yeah, but it's, it's, 
it's really great. It's helped me out a lot. I mean, I can eat. I can sleep now. I can actually sit down and relax instead of just sitting there shaking and being all tense and, and having every muscle and joint in my body hurt because I just can't relax. And it's, it's amazing. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a great feeling. And I love it.